Hello everyone, my name is Rahul and welcome to my channel Rahul Kiva Labs. So in this series of tutorials, we will be uh, looking at a very important and good test management tool uh, that is called uh, Test Collab. So uh, the series uh, in the series, we will be discussing about what is Test Collab, uh, how we can access Test Collab and what all different features it uh, provides uh, to the community. So uh, let's start. Okay, so uh, what is Test Collab? So Test Collab is a test management tool uh, which helps various teams to manage testing, right? So there are several teams, uh, you know, in a project. Uh, so with the help of this test management tool, uh, we can manage the testing uh, activities. Uh, coming to second point, it provides integration with major bug trackers and with different automation tools. So uh, when we do uh, some testing, right? So we do find some bugs. So Test Collab provides you with uh, the different uh, uh, integration uh, mechanism so that you can integrate it with major bug trackers like, you know, Mantis BT or uh, uh, Jira, etc. And uh, it also provides support for a different automation tools. So you can integrate uh, your uh, uh, scenarios uh, with different automation tools and uh, you can continue testing. So uh, third point is that it supports two-way integration that is with Jira and uh, Redmine, etc. Uh, you can manage requirements, you can create test plans, uh, you can create test cases, test suits, uh, you can run the test cases, uh, you can generate reports and do the scheduling tasks with the help of Test Collab. So in short, like Test Collab is a very good uh, tool uh, that offers uh, different features um, as listed and uh, shown on this slide. Uh, which can be utilized uh, so that uh, the, the software or the project uh, becomes better and we are able you know to manage the complete life cycle uh, through a single tool that is test collab so uh, i would say like it's a great tool uh, for the management of qa needs and so let's see some important components which helps us uh, in testing Okay, so uh, these are the test collab components. Uh, there's a small diagram uh, representation here. So uh, if I talk about uh, the project, so uh, the very basic thing is uh, we need a project to start with, right? So uh, test collab, we can create, you know, different projects and uh, you can upload or create uh, the requirements uh, in uh, the tool itself. Uh, then you can uh, create the test cases and you can plan the test suits uh, as per the requirement. Uh, you can create the test plan uh, inside test collab and of course you can do the test execution so uh, these are the several components uh, uh, as a part of test collab uh, test management tool that it provides and uh, it will be very helpful you know for the qa needs coming to next slide so um, uh, you can do you know a team management uh, in this particular tool like you can add a uh, new users say for example a particular team is working uh, in a project so we have different team members right so you can uh, add a new team members with the help of uh, the team management feature which uh, test collab provides uh, you can manage the different user roles and uh, the different permissions uh, granted uh, to a particular uh, person say for example a tester will have uh, you know different rights as compared to a test lead so tester may uh, have the right to you know execute the test cases and uh, the test lead may have a right to create test plans and uh, you know review the test cases and provide some comments or editing the test cases so it depends on uh, what kind of rights you are uh, you know providing uh, to a particular user so that can be you know managed uh, from the tool itself <clears throat> Then it also provides you with uh, the hierarchy and ranks uh, facility so that we will see in the uh, coming tutorials what is the meaning of that uh, you can upgrade a user to an administrator so uh, as i said like different users are there so up, you can upgrade a particular you know a tester is there you can upgrade it to a test lead or you know test manager or a test or administrator right and even you can do a downgrade like uh, uh, making uh, you know a test lead as a tester so all are related to permissions and that is all these things you can do through the team management feature uh, that is provided in test collab okay so uh, that will be a kind of, of you know a short introduction to test collab and in the later coming uh, videos we will see uh, how we'll go uh, component wise and we will see how we can uh, uh, 
create the components like projects, uh, test plans, test suits, and how we can uh, leverage the use of this tool for the betterment of uh, the project of the software so keep learning and this is the reference uh, you can refer this particular uh, link out here and you will get to know more information about test collab test management tool so uh, that's it from my side and if you uh, like my videos so uh, please do subscribe my channel for more such content on uh, testing and uh, keep learning thank you very much bye bye